Hey everybody, the Game of Guru 51 here, and welcome back to Chrono Trigger Blind. In the last episode, with the help of our friends and the power of the Chrono Trigger, we finally brought back Chrono into our party once again. And that makes me extremely happy because I was really upset when he died, and because he is one of our best party members in terms of lightning users. So I'm just really glad to have him back in general. It's just super awesome. And in this episode, we're going to be starting one of many side quests that we now have available to us because, let's face it, there's still a lot to do before we even take down Lavos. We could technically do that right now, but as you guys were telling me in the comments, that it's just not a good idea. There are so many things we could do right now to get some really good items and stuff from all the other side quests that we can do that I just want to do all of those things, do the final dungeon, and then be prepared enough to fight Lavos. So, anyways, let's go and see what you guys have to say. Corno, Corno, Corno. Fight Lavos. Isla Village have strong defense item. Go see. Oh, okay. Take Isla Chrono. Yeah, I, I like my trio right now. Now that Chrono's here, everyone's cheerful. The origin of machines? You mean to tell me I have a birthplace? Oh, it even tells you where to start the side quest. That is super convenient. Don't put us through that again. Solar energy was used with Aeon to go well before Lavos energy existed. It might be just a thing we need to defeat Lavos. That is so cool. I love how it shows you. Which means other party members might have uh, things to say too about the side quests. So this one says Father, which means we have to go to Guardia Castle. So you know what, let me go ahead and see what happens if I were to bring... If Magus and Frog would have stuff, uh, stuff to say for us. Look at you, ladies weep over you, right and left. The King's spirit which wanders. It can't be. Okay, cool. I just want to see what everybody has to say at this point. You got whacked because you're weak. Cretans, and they're still alive? By the way, Ozzy had a hideout much like my castle. Ooh, okay. Okay, now that I have an idea of which side quest to start first, I now know which one I want to do first. And that is, we're going to take down Ozzy in his lair because, I don't know, he escaped us twice now and that really kind of makes me salty, so the third time should be the charm this time and I think it's just in our best interest for me to start this one off. I'm glad that they gave us a starting point to start the side quest, it's just really cool to me because I'm not going to get completely lost as to which one to do, but now that I have an idea we can actually go ahead and start those in any order that we like. So now where the heck was that lair? Right here. Let's go ahead and enter Ozzy's Fort as our next, as our first side quest. Come on in, this is the great Ozzy's place. What the? Whoa! You, you're the great Magus! You're doing well, Ozzy. The nerve! Deserting your fellow mystics to serve these humans! You're a traitor! You're not our king! Why did you desert us? Oh, he is not gonna get away from me this time, let me tell ya. And there's no save point, so whatever. Hopefully there's one coming up. You pesky low down, good for nothings. Ooh, I'll have you begging for mercy. Flee! Oh no. You sent for me? Well, if it isn't Sir Magus, who'd you bribe to get in here? Traitors like you deserve a beating. Oh, great Ozzy, stand back and let me take care of these Cretans. I'm counting on you, Flea. Oh, please. Get ready for a slapping good time. Get it? Huh. Let's just do this. Come on. You're really easy. And you know what? I have Spire, which is a really good dual tech that I like to use with Frog and Chrono. And this should be doing a ton of damage. Let's be honest here. Yo, look at that. Look at that damage, man. You can't even handle the power. I'm gonna go for Dark Bomb just to see what that does since we haven't really had the chance to go for that yet. And I'm kind of curious just to see what it does. Ooh, look at that damage, man. And that's, wow, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Oh, just you wait. We'll teach you a lesson. Wow. Okay, that's fine. That was pretty easy, not gonna lie. And, oh, don't tell me we have this crap again. Howdy! You're nothing but common thieves. Anyone who tries to steal my treasure is looking for a very cruel death. 
Oh boy, we have enemies. And away we go. Oh, don't tell me this is going to be extremely easy. Wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oz. Oz is in a pickle. Out of here. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> what the heck was that? You still haven't given up? Well, how about a good thrashing? Slash! You rang? Slash, don't let me down. At first, I really didn't want to slice and dice you, but now it sounds kind of fun. Ready? Alright, Super Slash. Alright, let's go for Spire. I'm gonna go for Dark Bomb. And just completely demolish these fools. Yeah, look at that damage, man. You can't even handle the power right now. Well, definitely Magus has to stay in the party for the fight against Ozzy, but I think I'm going to switch out Frog. Just because, I don't know, Frog... I don't know, he, he's had a lot of screen time lately, and so, I mean, so has Magus, but I don't know. Let's see, let's go for Dark Bomb again and go for Spire, and I'm guessing you're going to go down after this attack, just like Flea did. Yep, for sure. That's a lot of XP. Chrono got a level up, though, which is really nice. Ouch. Alrighty. Cool stuff. Alright, let's go ahead and switch out Frog and put in somebody I haven't really used much lately. Uh, uh, well, Robo's the lowest of the level, so let's go ahead and bring him in instead. I don't know. Just trying to bring some new characters in that we haven't seen. Not new characters, but ones we haven't seen in forever. Come on, sweethearts. Ooh, I want that chest. Got a full ether. Maha, gotcha. Wait. I feel like that lowered my. Oh my god, it did. Look at my HP. Well, who cares? <laughs> I have the heal beam. I can heal everybody in an instant, and everything's okay. Look at that. Look at that HP. Alright, now that we're good to go, let's just keep on moving. <laughs> not so fast, friends. I'm not gonna make it that easy for you. Ozzy Pants. Flea Vest. Slasher 2. These unique items make us invincible. Oh, here we go. This is what I wanted to see. Now we can finally take down these fools. So let's go ahead and just get right on to it. I'm gonna go for a Dark Bomb on you. And of course, I want to hit Ozzy first, just for the power. Delta Force 3 monster technique. Oh, okay. That, that could have been a lot worse than I thought it would be. But that wasn't that bad, to be honest. Well, let's see if we can take down these guys. I wonder how much HP Flea and Slash have. I'm guessing quite a bit. And that is some damage. I need to heal. Okay, 43 is not that bad, but let's go ahead and go for the heal beam. That way, Robo can get the healings in there, of course, because Robo is our healer, as well as Frog, but Robo has been a really good healer lately, so I really want to keep him around. Now, let's go for Confuse again. I'm going to do this on Slash this time. I think he's the one I want to go for first. I don't know. I figured might as well go for one person at a time, because attacking Ozzy seems to go for a really dangerous Delta attack that I don't want to deal with. So just going for one at a time and then taking down Ozzy. Hopefully he does not get away from me this time. He got away from us twice, guys. I hate this guy. And that's the reason why I wanted to do this side quest first. Because I, I know we just have a lot of unfinished business with this fool. So, I don't know. I might be a little bit salty. But who cares, man? Who really cares? And can you stop hitting Magus? Please stop hitting Magus. Like, he didn't do anything. Let's just go for the heal beam. And I do have a way to bring people back to life with Chrono, so I mean, that's pretty sweet, in and of it, bleh, bleh. in and of it itself, and of course, Dark Bomb, hopefully we can finish off Bleed this time, that's a ton of damage that we're going for here, there you go, now who's it gonna go for, oh, it's gonna go for you, okay, that's a ton of damage, luckily there's no more Delta attacks since all three of them are pretty much, or the first one's dead, so, now it's time to go for Flea, and let's just 
heal up again, and then go for Dark Bomb. At this point, I might as well go for Fire 2, Ice 2, or Lightning 2. And no way. Okay. Well, if you want to escape me, at least one person won't here. Let's just finish off Ozzy right now. Let's just go for that Dark Bomb. If he gets away from me, I am going to be super salty. And he won't get away from me. He won't. I promise. He won't do this. So let's go for another Dark Bomb. And I'm going to have uh, Robo just do a really powerful attack that will do some damage. But of course, we're just going to hit this guy with everything we have. There's nothing he can do. I mean, at this point, he's pretty much good to go. He's be dead. Let's go for a Robo Attack and see how much damage that does. See, that's a ton of damage, even right now. Confuse, Dark Bomb. Man, he's not even attacking, so I don't know what he's trying to do here. Maybe he just knows he can't win. Yeah, he's done. Got a level up for Robo, Magus. Pretty sweet. What in the... That's it? He got away? Got a dash ring? Got a slight... Or a sight cap. What does that do? Oh, I'm in the wrong area here. Sight cap prevents chaos. I don't know what that means. We also did get a dash ring as well. Which gives us speed plus three. But I think I, at this point, I want to keep everybody in their equipment that I got for them. Because, I don't know. It just seems pretty useful if I have to say. So. Alrighty then. Is there any other treasure chests in here? No, that's it. Alright, let's keep on moving then. Magus, you lied when you said you wanted to create a world of evil. You used me! Oh, how dreadful. Say, can you hear that? It's the sound of the Reaper. I can't lose. What would have become of my mystics? I must win! Oh, come on. Seriously? This? What are you aiming at, you fool? Oh. Okay. Okay. I see what we have to do here. Let's go for Confuse. And hit this thing. I think we've this I think this happened before somewhere. I don't know. Mwaha, gotcha. Oh no freaking way. Adios, amigos. Did I hit the wrong thing? Did I hit the wrong thing? Never, you will never defeat me. What? It's a kitty! N no, not that switch! <laughs> Get the heck out of there. The past is dead. It was all just a dream. Did... So... Was that it? Was there nothing else to do? Is he gone? Is there a way we can go see what happened? Or is that it? Okay. I think that might be it, actually. What a really short side quest. Unless there's more to it than that, I have no idea. But, I mean, since we already did a side quest, I might as well end things off here. Which is weird. Well, what would happen if I go to this area in 1000 AD? If it even exists in 1000 AD? No, it does not exist in 1000 AD. So we might have completely finished the side quest entirely. Which is very weird. Okay, I guess I'm not going to complain, since we already did a side quest that leaves five more to go. So... I think that's going to be it for this episode, since we've already done a side quest. I mean, that's crazy. But, alright, I guess I'll take it. Next time on Chrono Trigger Blind, we're going to do yet another side quest involving one of the characters here. And I'll figure out what that is when we start off the next episode, because I honestly have no idea which one to start. I guess it really doesn't matter. I can pick whichever one I want to start first. But if you guys want to give me suggestions or whatever, just leave your suggestions in the comments, and I'll do whichever one first. 
or otherwise I'll just pick it. Who really knows? But with that being said, everybody, thank you guys so very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time for some more Chrono Trigger Blind. See you guys then.